Hi everyone, I'm very excited to share our free Flowdesk templates that are made possible by our collaboration with Flowdesk. Flowdesk is my email service provider of choice. So since I've started my company, Square Stylist, in 2020, I've used Flowdesk and I've loved it until today. So I've used Flowdesk since they were in beta, but now they are fully fledged email service provider packed with robust features. But as most of you know, I am such an advocate of recommending the right platform depending on a brand's use case. And that's why you'll find that I also have a course all about Klaviyo because for some of my e-commerce clients, they really need a robust data engine that has deep integration with Shopify. And so I recommend Klaviyo for most of my Shopify clients, but for most service providers, often those who are using Squarespace like myself, I recommend using Flowdesk because of their delightful interface as well as their simple and straightforward pricing. And this is why I'm so excited to share these free Flowdesk templates that will allow you to easily get started in using Flowdesk. Or if you're already using Flowdesk, these are templates which you can add to your dashboard so you can use them as needed. I intentionally wanted to create templates with vintage charm as well as minimal sections. You can treat them as blank canvas where you can easily add your content as well as apply your visual identity. We thoughtfully handcrafted three beautiful free Flowdesk templates for you. First is the nurture template, which is designed for you to easily send newsletters or updates to your audience. Next is the curate template, which has prompts and sections designed for you to easily showcase images, products, and experiences that inspire you. Lastly, the launch template is designed for you to introduce an offer or a new service. It's incredibly easy to make these templates your own. So here is an example of how we customize the launch template with a different brand and color system, as well as different content and images. In the description box below this video, you'll be prompted to sign up to our mailing list and then you will receive the email with the links to these templates. So once you access the links, you'll be prompted to use our templates. So for the nurture template, it looks like this. You can preview how it looks on desktop and on mobile. And all we need to do is click start designing now. If you already have a Flowdesk account, then it will automatically load the template for you. However, if you don't have a Flowdesk account just yet, then you'll be prompted to create a free trial account. On your end, it should look like this. And note that for most part, we used WebSafe fonts for you to easily access this exact design. And then you can easily just swap the images. Notice how you can remove these placeholder images and just add your own. Also for this logo part, you may delete this placeholder image and just apply your own logo. It's quite easy to customize the other parts of the template. For example, if I just click on the canvas, we'll be able to access the global styles. So for example, if I'd like to change the canvas color right here, I can change this to my preferred color. So for this template, I intentionally wanted the backdrop color and the canvas color to be the same such that the image cards will be more prominent there. And then again, you can simply click on the relevant blocks to change their colors. Aside from colors, we may also change our fonts like right now I'm using our website font courier, but if you'd like to switch to another font, then you can use these options and you may also adjust the size. One tip is for us to use our favorites option. 
For example, if you wish to reuse elements like this button, I recommend clicking this heart icon to save this block to your favorites. Once you do that, if you wish to use that after this section, then all we need to do is access that by clicking favorites, and then we'll be able to add that button in just one click. Please note as well that we need to change the links because the template comes with a link that leads to my website. So for example, for this button, please make sure that this is linked to the proper URL. And then for this image card, notice how this block has a link attached to it. Make sure to replace those. We may also attach links to selected texts. For example, this is a text and all I need to do is click the link icon. Upon pasting the link, we'll find that this add link actions option will now be enabled. What this allows us to do is to trigger actions such as adding a subscriber to a segment or removing them based on whether or not they click this link. This is such a handy feature and there are more features and blocks that you can add to your Flowdesk campaign. Um, notice how if I click this plus icon, we can add other blocks such as layouts, images, videos, or so. One block that might be helpful, especially if you're using the launch template is the countdown. Once added, there will be a lot of other layout options that you may choose from. Feel free to explore these options and just make sure that the colors and the typography matches your own visual brand identity. I also would like to mention that there are blocks that allow us to access more typography options other than the web safe ones. Like for example, when I chose this layout block, notice if I click this text, I will have access to more fonts. While some of these fonts might be closer to your brand fonts, I recommend being careful when using these blocks or just making sure that you balance the use of these blocks with the use of web safe fonts like these ones that are built in to the text blocks because these layout blocks with more font options will actually be rendered as an image when delivered to your subscribers. And this might not be as accessible as text blocks. So feel free to use these layout blocks, which are so stylish, but use them in moderation. So typically when creating a campaign, I try to balance the use of layout blocks and text blocks, because again, text blocks are using web safe fonts that are more accessible to more users. As soon as you're happy with the content and the design of your campaign, you may send a test to your personal email address before sending them to your subscribers. Hope you enjoy using our Flowdesk templates. Please tag us on Instagram at Queer Stylist if you're loving these resources.